He's like my child. I don't know what I'd do without him. No matter what kind of day I've had, if I get home and they're so excited to see you, if you've gone for five hours or five minutes. She's definitely one of the family. It's like having another kid. Even as they grow older, they just don't move around as much. I am a bit concerned because she likes to jump. She takes flying leaps and jumps on the bed. So I would hate to see her lose that in later life. Hi, and welcome to Pause in Motion. My name's Jessica, and it's my pleasure to share with you an essential product that will help keep your pet fit, active, happy, and healthy. That product is Flex Pet. Did you know that over 90% of older cats have painful arthritis, and one out of every five dogs over the age of seven suffers from joint pain? What if I told you there was a way to ease their suffering? What if I told you the suffering can be prevented in the first place? It can with Flex Pet. Flex Pet is an all natural joint health supplement created with human grade ingredients right here in the US. Scientifically designed to relieve and prevent aching joints in both dogs and cats. Throughout the show, we're gonna be hearing testimonials, taking your pet health calls, and saying hi to some adorable furry friends. We'll also learn the history behind Flex Pet and why it is so effective. But right now, let's meet one of the foremost voices in pet health and our resident expert, Dr. David Randall. Dr. Randall is a second generation veterinarian with 30 years of experience and is the owner of the Big Cypress Animal Clinic in South Florida, specializing in aging pets. Dr. Randall, so good to see you again. Hey Jessica, it's great to see you again. Now, I already know who you are, but for people who don't, right. tell us a little bit about your background and who you are. I was uh, raised in a veterinarian family. Started practicing the greatest profession in the world, taking care of horses, dogs, and cats. And um, I don't feel like I've ever worked a day in my life. Veterinary medicine is a great profession. How did you come to know Flex Pet? Flex Pet actually came and found me. I do a weekly call in veterinarian show. Somebody must have saw it and they said, Hey, have you ever tried this? I said, I know nothing about it whatsoever. But I did realize by looking at it that it's, it wasn't just a joint supplement, okay? It was extra. There was, there was some really good, good science that's gone into this product. Mm -hmm. So I looked at it, and then um, I think I got a half a dozen bottles or something and thought I'd give it a try. But uh, one of my workers had his dog that was lame for about three weeks. Okay. I was not taking care of it. Another veterinarian was taking care of it. And they had it on some different type of uh, limping medication, okay? Mike came to me after about three weeks because the dog was still limping and it had symptoms of vomiting and diarrhea. I mean, come on, whatever it was, it, it wasn't it was working, bad. okay? Yeah. He came to me and said, you know, well, what do you think about that product? Do you think it would work? And I said, well, it's worth a try because the other stuff is not making your dog feel any better. Right. So um, immediately he puts the dog on FlexBed. I think he was getting three pills maybe once or twice a day. Mike came back to me and said, you're not going to believe this, but he's better. Then um, I said, well, I don't believe it, okay? So uh, the second day he came in there and he said, you have to come out, you have to come out in the parking lot. I want you to see my dog, okay? He goes out there and the dog's walking and trotting completely normal. And I'm like, what else is he on? It was Nothing. just the flex pet. Yeah, there's no vomiting, no diarrhea, and it really seemed to make a difference. I've tried it many, many times since then, and it works. And that's, that's the bottom line, the product works. That was my experience with flex pet for the first time, so I'm sold. Wow, that's a great story. What about on a broader scale? You see all types of pets coming in and out of your office. I see little chihuahuas, little teacup uh, Yorkies, mm -hmm. all the way to Great Danes. That's what okay. I have. I have a small dog, but he's old. He's right. seven. Right. Well, so. that's, see, that's not old. I think that should be not even midlife right there. Okay, We'll okay. get into that also in the future. Okay, But this is something that you want to use on your younger pets mm -hmm. to try to prevent joint ails. And then the older pets, they're all, once you, have a, once you have a dog that's over eight, nine years of age, you're guaranteed there's gonna be arthritis, okay? okay? In the hips, in the lumbar, in the shoulders, they're just, they're gonna have aches and pains. And a lot of it has to do with the breeding. The purebreds have more injuries than the Heinz 57. The Heinz 57 are healthier dogs, okay? But also our housing and our flooring, okay? Back when we had a lot of carpeting, right? Dogs had padding, they had carpet, they could lay on it, and they had traction. Now, all you're looking at is laminate floors, hardwood floors, marble tile or tile that's out there, okay? The dogs can't, they, they can't stand on it. It cripples them, okay? I didn't know that. You'll see, you'll see commercials where a puppy's running into the kitchen to get food and he wipes out, okay? Yeah. They thought it was really cool. What did I see when I saw that commercial? It's like, it, there it is again. It's the flooring. You're just adding. Okay? Right, you're just you're just problem. breaking breaking it up and stuff. Okay, that that's why you know even in people you don't you don't take a child and treat them like they're an adult as far as putting them through boot camp. Okay, mm -hmm. you can't. You just tear up the joints. But um, 
you know, to get back with it, the little the little dogs and the young dogs and stuff, I like to just start them on by the time they're uh, three, four months of age. Just put a little bit into their food. And uh, by the time they, you know, they're becoming mature, they're one, two years of age, just do it daily. Um, and I would just keep it on right for the rest of their life. And it sounds like you've had great results off of it so far. I, I'm sold. I'm absolutely sold on it. Well, I definitely want to talk to you more about it. So let's take a short break and we'll do that when we come back. Sound good? Sounds great. Great. Well, we'll be right back on Paws in Motion right after this special offer for Flex Pet. Joint pain is the leading cause of discomfort for aging pets. Now there's a simple solution, and it's called FlexPet. FlexPet is the only product featuring the powerful ingredient CMA, scientifically proven to both prevent and relieve joint pain for cats and dogs. Call now to order the two-bottle FlexPet starter kit, and we'll add a third bottle absolutely free. And your entire order is guaranteed or your money back. So what are you waiting for? Get your pets the relief they deserve. Call the number on the screen right now or visit FlexPet.com. Hey, I love to take calls. Let's take our first call. Let's do it. This is uh, Jillian. Hi, Jillian. Where are you from? Hi, I'm from Los Angeles. Okay, and what's your question for Dr. Randall? Well, at what age do cats typically develop arthritis? That's a great question right there. Uh, Jillian, let me ask you something. Uh, what, what type of cat do you have? I have a seven-year-old Siamese. Very nice, very nice. What's her name? Chocolate. All right, there you go. <laughs> All right, so let me tell you something about cats. Um, some cats actually start arthritis at two and three years of age because you know how they jump around and they play and they're really aggressive. The outdoor cats have more problems than your Siamese is going to have. The outdoor cats have to go up trees, they have to go upstairs, and they really have a lot of, you know, battles out there to, um, uh, to fight with. But um, by about seven years of age, the average cat is going to start to show signs of degenerative joint disease in the hips. You think that they're just slowing down because they, uh, they're getting older, but really it's just because their joints hurt and they don't want to jump up on the, uh, up on the bed. They don't want to jump around. Um, I can give you a suggestion as far as a treatment if you'd like. Uh, NSAIDs cannot be used on cats. That would be your Tylenol type products, okay? Please don't give that to a cat. And never give ibuprofen to a dog. Absolutely, positively, it is fatal to dogs and fatal to cats, okay? So, you're really limited as far as a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory. So what I like to do is I like to think about preventative care, okay? Which means uh, make sure that you keep their toenails trimmed so they're not getting caught in things. Make sure that you, um, make sure that they exercise a lot. And then you may as well go ahead and start your kitty on FlexPet, which is absolutely fantastic. It separates itself from any other product out there with the uh, CM8 as well as the MSM. Uh, collagen type 2 and the digestive enzymes. Okay, so what that does is when you give the cat the, um, the flex pet, it gets absorbed into the system. What happens so many times is that you'll give them some type of a supplement and if it doesn't have the digestive enzymes to actually get absorbed, it goes in one end and out the other end. Okay, so what you want to do is take one of the pills and just take a quarter of the tablet. Okay, crumble it up, sprinkle it into the canned food and just, just mix it up. It's going to be the best thing you can do for her. Okay, Thank you so much, Dr. Randall. Thank you very much for your call. Have a good day. Bye, Jillian. We asked actual FlexPet users to film their success stories and share them with us. This is one of those stories. Hello, my name is Tamara, and I have a dog, Tucker. He's 17, and uh, about four years ago, he really started losing his uh, mobility, and he didn't want to move around as much or go up and down the stairs at all. And it kind of concerned me. I kept an eye on him, and one day I came home, and he was... He was shaking, I could tell he was in pain. I took him to the vet and they wanted to put him on uh, steroids, which I knew was a, a temporary fix. I did not want to do that long term. And I was at my local pet store talking about my situation and a lady overheard and recommended Flex Pet. I went home and I did some research. I really liked what I read. I liked the fact that it was all natural. About three weeks later, I noticed he started just moving around a lot more and following us up and down the stairs. and. It's been four years and he follows us up and down the stairs all the time. He has so much energy and I know it's because he feels good because his joints don't hurt. And I just love the fact that Flex Pet is all natural and it just really gave him back his, his mobility. And I'm so thankful for that. 
Joint pain is the leading cause of discomfort for aging pets. Now there's a simple solution, and it's called FlexPet. FlexPet is the only product featuring the powerful ingredient CMA, scientifically proven to both prevent and relieve joint pain for cats and dogs. Call now to order the two-bottle FlexPet starter kit, and we'll add a third bottle absolutely free. And your entire order is guaranteed or your money back. So what are you waiting for? Get your pets the relief they deserve. Call the number on the screen right now or visit FlexPet.com. So, Dr. Randall, this is a special guest that we have here with us today. That Who is, is this? that's Billy Bob the Beagle. I was on vacation out of town about two weeks ago, and um, somebody pulled in and actually ran him over. They ran okay, him over. they did. Oh, uh, really? Luckily, they did realize it, and it just injured the one leg. You know, he's been on antibiotics up till today. Okay. And uh, FlexPet is actually what we're going to do today. So you're going to okay? start him it's on FlexPet yes, today. Yes, I need something to start helping his joints and everything. Okay. So can he take some right now? He can take some. Billy. Come here, Billy Bob. Big. Come on. Oh, Come oh, on, oh, 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 oh. There you Come go. Come here, man. Get you some of that. Hmm? Yeah. Get you some more of that right there. That's good. Do they basically eat it like a treat? They do. I'll yeah. I may have to break it up for like a while. Have you ever tried one of these? No. Oh, no. I, well, first of all, it's human grade. Okay. Are you about it's, to eat that? Why not? I know it's all natural. Absolute, I think it's absolutely delicious. <laughs> Billy likes it. Oh, man. I'm sorry. It tastes like powdered meat. That's what Ew. dogs like. <laughs> dogs love meat. Okay. I'll let Billy Bob have that. All right. Are you a vegetarian? I'm not, but if meat tasted like this, I would be. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me tell you something. It's all human grade material. Okay. Right, and I would natural. never give my pet something that I was afraid to consume myself. It may have a different taste than what you're used to, okay? But you could eat it, but it's, it's really not well, for human for consumption. Pets. Well, I was going to ask you because a lot of animals have sensitive stomachs mm -hmm. or special diets. Right. So how does this work with that? Well, it's got the digestive enzymes inside there. Okay. okay? So, and that's what you're really looking for because you want, you want fast and better absorption, mm -hmm. right? So you're not going to have any GI upsets. It's really easy for them to digest. And you put that combination together, there's not going to be any stomach upsets. No vomiting, no diarrhea. Now, how many would you give him? Well, normally a dog his size, he'd take one in the morning and one at night, okay? He wants more. But, oh my gosh, one in the morning, luckily he got his teeth cleaned when, when he had his leg <laughs> surgery, okay? Oh my God. He won't stop eating it. Come here, Billy Bob, I he have won't. one more if you want it. But, yeah, he um, can have mine. He, here, uh, he can have uh, mine. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm so, good with I'm Flex sorry pet. for you. <laughs> sorry for you, Jess. All right. But anyway, no, it's, um, you know, tomorrow get his sutures out and I'll just keep him on this. Mm -hmm. um, he's going to be on Flex Pet. And I'm expecting within 10 to 14 days that he's uh, using the leg and not ever looking back. Well, we know Billy Bob's going to be in good hands with Flex Pet and you, Dr. Randall. Call now to order the Flex Pet 2 bottle starter pack and we'll throw in a third bottle absolutely free. Plus, your entire order comes with an unconditional money back guarantee. Call the number on the screen right now or visit FlexPet.com. So you're the expert when it comes to Flex Pet. You have a lot of people coming in and out of your clinic and they have common questions. I'm sure they ask you all they the do. time. So I have a few for you. Okay, fire okay. away. All right, um, a lot of products already have glucosamine in them. Absolutely. What makes FlexPet different? The difference is, yes, there's glucosamine in here, but it's the complete formula. You get the whole package, the CM8, okay? It's literally like a lubricant for the joints. Just think of it as WD-40, okay. okay? So it really does a really nice job. It reduces inflammation, and it nourishes the cartilage, and that's what you want. You want nice, healthy cartilage to produce more synovial fluid and bathe the cells in its own nutrition. This is what FlexPet does. So this is getting to the root of the problem mm -hmm. rather than just, you know, coating it. Absolutely. How long before people start usually seeing results? Amazingly, I've seen it actually work within two days, okay, 48 hours, but normally what you should expect is about two to three weeks. Um, take at least two bottles because the entire order is guaranteed. So if the pet doesn't like it, if you're not satisfied with it, it's money back guaranteed. There you go. All right, and lots of pets are already on medication. Mm -hmm. um, does Flex Pet seem to interact with that? Absolutely, positively no. There's no drug interaction with this right here. It gets to the root of the problem by healing the joints naturally without harmful side effects. This is truly the real McCoy. You do know your stuff. Thank you, Dr. Randall. Jessica, let's take another call. Okay, who do we have on the line? Hey Jessica, this is Joe from Birmingham. How are you? I'm good, Joe. From one Alabamian to another, what's your question? Exactly. 
I got a, a German Shepherd, and it's a puppy. It's about eight, nine months old, and it's uh, it's growing pretty quick right now. But um, it's having this weird problem, Doc. It, it's like it can't keep all its weight on one side for very long. All right, let, let me tell you what normally happens at that age. You did say German Shepherd, right? It is. It's a German okay. Shepherd. All right, you sound like a nice big Alabama boy, okay? And I bet you when you were coming up, you used to have growing pains. Your your legs were hurting. Your mama said, you've got growing pains. Don't worry about it. You'll grow out of it, right? Yeah, I did have that. I, 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 had I, that. I, I know you did, okay? So it is actually growing pains. There's a medical term for it. It's called panosteitis. And what happens is that as the bones grow, the periosteum, the covering of the bone where the nerves are, gets stretched and it's extremely painful, okay? so. Number one is I want you to slow up the amount of food that you're giving that dog, cut it down by about 25%, let's slow up the growth. I want you to get him on Flex Pet immediately. Three pills in the morning, three pills at night. Over the next six months, that dog will level off and he'll not be lame anymore, okay? But slow up on the amount of groceries, start him on his Flex Pet. And um, after about three months, four months, then you can probably go down to a maintenance dose of maybe just three pills once a day, okay? Okay, we can do that, War Dam Eagle. That's right, War Eagle, thanks for the call. <laughs> Joint pain is the leading cause of discomfort for aging pets. Now there's a simple solution, and it's called FlexPet. FlexPet is the only product featuring the powerful ingredient CMA, scientifically proven to both prevent and relieve joint pain for cats and dogs. Call now to order the two-bottle FlexPet starter kit, and we'll add a third bottle absolutely free. And your entire order is guaranteed or your money back. So what are you waiting for? Get your pets the relief they deserve. Call the number on the screen right now or visit FlexPet.com. You're watching Paws in Motion. This is Michael, he's a kennel manager, and this is Mojo. We had the opportunity to visit him at his kennel, and these two have an incredible story to share. Mojo came to us when he was six weeks old. Police department found him running around in the woods. He was covered in mange, demodex, bug bites, just bad, bad, poor health. So I adopted him, took him home, and at about Four months, he started having a problem walking. He was so bad, I would have to carry him from the bed to outside to go to the bathroom and then carry him to my truck to come to work. I couldn't figure out what to do for him. And nothing seemed to work? Or? Yeah, I've tried other things like injections and all kinds of different medications and nothing really worked for him. And then uh, somebody introduced us to FlexPet. After about a week of giving him that, I started off on three a day for a week. Drastic improvement. I mean, he was running, playing, you know, didn't have that look on his face every time he took a step anymore. Uh -huh. It was just amazing. And then after two weeks, he was just completely normal. Do you take him for runs? What do you What do you do to keep him healthy and active? I can't keep him from running. That's all he does. And then we get home from work, and him and my other dog are around the house, up and down every piece of furniture, running around, running. And I've got two and a half acres fenced in out where I live, and they just go out there and all night long until I make them come inside. A lot of people have never heard of Flex Pet, but this is something obviously you'd recommend to others. Exactly. I'd never heard of it until somebody recommended it to me, and it's just amazing, amazing. Everybody I see that, you know, my dog's limping, I don't know what to do, or my dog's getting old, he can't walk anymore, I'm just passing it on because, like I said, it took him two weeks to become a totally different dog. He's sort of like your baby, you know, your child. You helped him out, you raised him, and now he's in great shape. You know, what does he mean to you? Actually, a lot more than just a pet. I mean, we were having some difficult times, and uh, I'm a recovering alcoholic, and uh, we had some, some things hit us that kind of got me thinking about some bad ideas, and... He just, if it wouldn't have been for him, I would have given up probably two and a half years of sobriety. So I want to do everything I can for him. He's like one of my children. He saved me and it saved him. So <laughs> what else are you going to say? Look at him, look how happy he is. Mike, you have such an inspirational story. I mean, you've had a dog that could barely move at all. And Flex Pet changed his life, but I think in a way it changed yours as well. Yeah, absolutely. It just broke my heart. It just killed me, you know, and somebody introduced FlexPet to me and mm -hmm. after two weeks he was, he was back to normal and running and playing and I mean, I don't consider him a pet, he's my best friend. Thank you so much for sharing your story with us. You're welcome.
Joint pain is the leading cause of discomfort for aging pets. Now there's a simple solution, and it's called FlexPet. FlexPet is the only product featuring the powerful ingredient CMA, scientifically proven to both prevent and relieve joint pain for cats and dogs. Call now to order the two-bottle FlexPet starter kit, and we'll add a third bottle absolutely free. And your entire order is guaranteed or your money back. So what are you waiting for? Get your pets the relief they deserve. Call the number on the screen right now or visit FlexPet.com. Dr. Randall, are you ready for another call? Absolutely. Okay. Who do we have on the line? Hi, I'm Susan. Welcome, Susan. What's your question for Dr. Randall? My husband, uh, against my wishes, has decided that he's going to feed our two miniature poodles uh, scraps from the table after dinner each night. And I think that this is bad, and he doesn't think it's a big deal. And I'm just concerned. Like, what, what could this possibly uh, do to their health in the long term? Um, the problem with feeding human food with the dog food is that you see how quickly they change over, okay? I mean, they're just like, nope, I'm not going to eat any dog food anymore. And the problem with that is that human food is more digestible and it has more calories. If you feed, if you feed just keep feeding human food, most of the pets are going to become obese, okay? Then you're going to have joint problems and it just, it just rolls downhill, okay? And you'd be surprised, especially with two small poodles, they only need, you know, four or five ounces of food a day. The, the modern kibble right now is so highly concentrated with calories and everything that you're actually hurting them by feeding them more. Um, are they getting plenty of exercise? Yes, they go on two walks a day for about 30 minutes each. Okay, do me a favor. Tell your husband that if he continues to feed them the human food that he's going to be doing five walks a day, okay? And he's going to be walking the dogs. Why did he decide to uh, start feeding them human food? Were they having some problems? No, I think he just wants them to love him more. <laughs> yeah, so what, pe what happens is that people love him to death until they become obese. So, uh, no, you're going to slowly take control of your husband and slowly take control of the pets over the next two weeks, okay? We asked actual FlexPet users to film their success stories and share them with us. This is one of those stories. Hi, my name's Chuck. I just wanted to talk a little about my dog, Phoenix. He's a retired bomb dog. They had to go with a real bad stroke and... Nobody thought he was going to make it. He laid on the floor, it couldn't move, couldn't walk. A friend gave us some Flex Pet. We tried that. Well, before we knew it, Phoenix was out there competing with my other dog, a younger Weimaraner, chasing a ball. We knew that the effects were really good, and that was uh, probably within a week to 10 days. After about 10 days, he managed to stand and stumble out of the house done his business in the yard, came in and laid down, and every day after that, he got better. And so here it is coming up on a year and a half, and he's getting around quite well, and he's really been a pleasure. And we want to thank you, FlexPet and Flexin. Call now to order the FlexPet two bottle starter pack, and we'll throw in a third bottle absolutely free. Plus, your entire order comes with an unconditional money back guarantee. Call the number on the screen right now or visit flexpet.com. Welcome back to Paws in Motion. Now, these guys are super, super cute, and they they're are. really young, too. So, it kind of begs the question how young is too young to start any animal on FlexPet? You know, eight to 10 weeks is a great age to start. They've already been dewormed, they've had vaccinations, they're okay. already on the heartworm prevention, mm -hmm. and now you, what you want to do is preventative medicine, okay? Mm -hmm. The little dogs, especially like the terriers and stuff, like these two little guys, mm -hmm. you know, they're really prone to having joint problems. So, um, on the kneecaps, the big dogs, go ahead and take a, a German Shepherd, Labrador Retriever, Golden Retriever, okay? It's their hips and their lumbar. So what you want to do is, what you want to do, you want some of this? Oh yeah, my goodness like sakes, he does like that. <laughs> but anyway, so what you want to do is start them at a young age, you know, with a small dose, get them used to it. And then, um, you know, uh, just try to prevent joint problems and stuff. Your active working dogs, okay? If you've got a dog that's working, he needs to be on the product completely. You want to avoid pain at any cost. Right, okay? this is prevention. This is prevention, and it's very, very, very affordable, okay? The dogs are going to live longer. They're going to have a better life, okay? Mm -hmm. And you're going to hopefully avoid the, um, the surgeries that these guys go through. I was about through. to say, these you know, guys can be my, very expensive in the long run. In my, in my clinic alone, okay, at least four to five dogs a week come in there that need to have ACL surgery, uh, hip replacement and stuff, okay? And we can either do it or we can send them out to, okay, here, you want some more? Or we can send them out to, um, you know, a board certified surgeon. What you want to try to do, Jessica, you want to avoid the surgeries, okay? Right. Uh, total hip replacement, 
you're looking at, you know, my God, two hips, $10,000 easily. That's okay. expensive. $3,500 to have ACL surgery done on them. And so we're just talking about right there, the knee, that could be, a, that could be your little Yorkshire Terrier, okay? Yeah. Your hip could be your, your German Shepherd. So, you know, why not try to prevent these? Yeah, it's better to put them on the flex pad early so you don't have to deal with all of that. Absolutely. Eight to ten weeks, preventative medicine, that's what I'm all about. That sounds great. Now, here's an amazing offer from Flex Pet. Joint pain is the leading cause of discomfort for aging pets. Now there's a simple solution, and it's called FlexPet. FlexPet is the only product featuring the powerful ingredient CMA, scientifically proven to both prevent and relieve joint pain for cats and dogs. Call now to order the two-bottle FlexPet starter kit, and we'll add a third bottle absolutely free. And your entire order is guaranteed or your money back. So what are you waiting for? Get your pets the relief they deserve. Call the number on the screen right now or visit FlexPet.com. We're here with founder and CEO of FlexPet, Tamer El Safi. Now, Tamer, how did you come up with the idea of FlexPet? What was your inspiration behind it? Well, I started uh, Flexin International uh, about 13 years ago, and I wanted to develop a human-grade formula for my ailing grandmother. Four years later, it evolved into uh, another product, which was FlexPet, because I found that the uh, existing customers that we had were breaking up the capsules and putting in their dog dish for their pets. <laughs> That's great. So we've heard a lot about FlexPet and the results that it gives, but what about the company itself? First and foremost, I pride myself in good quality customer care. So when a FlexPet customer calls, they're automatically part of the FlexPet family. All our customer service calls are in-house. It's 15 feet from my office. Uh, so we follow up with the customer. We make sure that their pets are taking the product right. So that's really my main goal is to give quality customer care. Many times I would call a company and I would get horrible customer service. And so that's made it my, my passion to really not only help animals, but also help uh, you know, the owners that are concerned about their animals. I mean, you see it in your, in your clinic. I see how you care about your patients that come in. Uh, I've seen it firsthand. They, they walk out of there and they're like, you know, Dr. Randall's the best. You know, he really cares about we my dog. We try it because you and I both have the same mission statement essentially in mind, okay? Good quality product, good customer care. That's, Absolutely. That's it. Yes. I think a major concern for a lot of people is the money factor. Well, you know, I, I totally understand that, but if you really look at the the grand scheme of things, the products are not really that expensive. FlexPet isn't expensive when you consider that if you don't use it as a preventative for your pet, and then you end up going to someone like Dr. Dr. Randall <laughs> that will pretty much... Or, you know, or if I send them over to a specialist. You know, if I send you over to a board-certified specialist to have bone plating or something like that done, or a knee replacement and all, you know, I mean, you can easily hit thousands, thousands of dollars. Okay? Absolutely. And they're still going to be put on FlexPet, okay, afterwards. Right. So. Right as a good preventative start the flex pet at a young age keep them on it keep the joints healthy don't let them get overweight and it's really a savings it's a savings for the people and the pets live longer absolutely Jessica I've put my heart and soul into this I'm very very passionate about it I started this to help my grandmother and now I feel very fortunate because now I'm helping people help their pets right I stand behind my product that's why I guarantee the entire first order or your money back Call now to order the Flex Pet 2 Bottle Starter Pack and we'll throw in a third bottle absolutely free. Plus, your entire order comes with an unconditional money back guarantee. Call the number on the screen right now or visit FlexPet.com. Tamer, thank you so much. Dr. Randall, thank you for being here You're as well. You're welcome. So, what did we learn about Flex Pet today? It works for pets both young and old as a solution and a preventative. It's pennies on the dollar compared to other alternatives out there. Pets love the taste, and best of all, it works. So do your pet a favor. Pick up the phone and give them the relief that they deserve. Thank you so much for joining us. Guys, thank you this again. Thank you for bringing yeah. this little guy.